Following the U.S. Coast Guard reconnaissance flight earlier today, the Culloch is upright, rocking with a slow motion, but stable. There is no indication of a spill. At the mercy of Mother Nature, nearly 500 members of the Unified Commander and Kodiak to help dislodge and salvage the Culloch oil rig, which ran aground Monday evening. The command says tropical storm force winds and massive waves have made those efforts extremely difficult. We're operating in a, in a marine environment in Alaska where we're moving in the winters of Alaska, which are extremely challenging um, conditions. Two ships, the AVIC and the Alert, had been struggling with those conditions for several days as the vessels attempted to move the Culloch to Seattle for repairs. The Coast Guard says around 4.30 Monday afternoon, the AVIC separated from the Culloch 15 miles offshore from Kodiak, and at that point, officials decided it was safer for the Alert to guide the rig to the safest place possible for grounding. The Culloch ended up southeast of Kodiak at Sikalidak Island. The current on-site observations... Uh, give no indication that we have current environmental or wildlife impact. Environmental monitoring will be in effect until salvaging is done. Nearly 150,000 gallons of diesel fuels on board the Culloch along with 12,000 gallons of hydraulic lubricants.